Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Amanda, AKA The Polished New Yorker. If you're new here on this channel, we talk about beauty, fitness, wellness, all under the umbrella of lifestyle. So if that's your judge, make sure you keep coming back. Stick around for more, okay? Today, I have an Ivy Park Rodeo try on haul slash lookbook and a review. I'm also gonna show you guys what I got from Flex Park, which was Ivy Park's swim collection. So yeah, stick around, let's hop right in. So guys, I think I'm just a fanatic. Like, it's like the fan in me because it doesn't make sense to, to like buy all of this stuff. Where am I wearing it to? Oh my gosh. But I did shop the Flex Park, which came out in July, I believe. I got a cap. This is just gonna be real quick. I got the cap, the bathing suit. Of course, I have a bucket. One side is, it has like this, um, like, like that towel material and it also has the monogram on one side and then it's plain on the other side. When I get myself on a beach, girl, stop playing. I'm gonna be so cute. I also got the beach bag which is really huge and you could put your whole life inside of here it has a bunch of inserts so you could put like your water bottle your shoes your water shoes what else can you put in here the rest of your life then you could put other smaller items in here maybe like a towel face towel lip gloss sunscreen your sunglasses you know things like that so catch me on the beach I don't know when, but I'll be on the beach and y'all want to see my Ivy Park. You want to see me in my Ivy Park? So, Ivy Park Rodeo. Very simply put, this collection was inspired by black cowboys of this country, of America. It features a lot of denims, some really nice colorways. So, you know how there's always a big hoopla around an Ivy Park drop? Well... I kind of contributed to that, you know, a little bit, as I should, <laughs> being part of the hive. I was like teetering between if I really wanted to get anything from this collection. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna take right into this box um, and show you what I have. So these uh, feature the colors, or they're the colors that are featured within the collection. You have this very nice periwinkle, this royal blue color, and this it's like a like a sore bait very very nice and I like I really wanted a set of socks because um, they're always so hard to get moving on I got the bucket of course this is monograms with the Ivy Park logo and I think it looks so fly I can't put it on right now because of my hairstyle but I can't wait to wear it it's so fly and it's reversible i think every ivy park drop if i continue to you know fan out i'm going to get a bucket i have my mind made up on that so it's reversible you can wear it like this and i think that is so cute like it's so cute <laughs> it's so cute the monogram side is my favorite so yeah and i also got the jacket the sports jacket which comes oversized and it's also detachable I'll show you a better view when I stand up but you can take it off you can take this bottom piece off and just wear it where the top part let's talk about the other item that I ordered online that I was not able to keep because of a sizing issue, which was also like the one, like the one item that I really, 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 really wanted. So it was the bodysuit. The bodysuit unfortunately ended up not working for me. It turned out to just be a huge problem because it was cut too short. It was too tight to get up over my hips and girl, like with hips, right? So <laughs> like it was, too small and I got it in a size small with the consideration that you know it's made out of denim it might not be a lot of stretch to it but 
I could barely get it up past my hips, but when I did, you know, it, it fit really nice in the, in the waist area, but then it was too short, like up here. So it was made, that made it too tight to, you know, move my arms and be comfortable in it, most importantly. But also like I got it in a size medium and that size didn't work for me as, as well. It was too big and the, um, the cup size was too big which made it too gappy in the front and then the shoulder straps were too way too big and then there was too much material in the crotch area so it just ended up not working and there were just like other issues that i think were like a not quality concern but they didn't really have like the consumer in mind when making the bodysuit which kind of sucks because i think a lot of people wanted that bodysuit and it ended up not working for a, a lot of people per reviews that i've read so those are the items that i had got online and the next day the following day i went to the store went to see if there was any other items that i wanted there wasn't really anything but i rationalized getting this skirt i got the cow print skirt guys it's so so cute I like this. I like this for me. I like it. <laughs> all right, guys, so now let's get into the lookbook part of it all, okay? The focal point on this look is the bodysuit. It's very structured, which creates really nice lines. And to keep everything from looking too busy, I paired it with a very simple skirt and blazer. Both of those have muted tones, and that allows the bodysuit to pop even more. Now you know this look is all about the cow print skirt. She's coming through causing a scene, honey, okay? <laughs> so I decided to keep everything else simple by pairing it with a long sleeve sheer shirt to create balance. And I threw on a little heel. Let me tell you how amazing this cover-up jacket is. Well, for one, it comes with four pockets, two at the top, two at the bottom, a drawstring where you can cinch near your waist, it has a hood, but the best part of it all is that it's detachable. So you can wear it as a duster or you can take the bottom piece off and wear it as a cropped jacket. I really enjoyed putting these outfits together. Let me know what your favorite look was from the lookbook. And if you bought anything or even had your eye on anything from Ivy Park Rodeo, share it with me in the comments below. Thanks so much for tuning in today, you guys. I really appreciate it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Visit me on Instagram at thepolishednyer. And yeah, I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.